feel like I should say welcome to Harley's first view, but if this is not a first view. Well, I guess it's sort of a first view. It's it's a uh, me playing a new game that I haven't played before. Watch Dogs 2. So I know very little about this game. I know the basic premise. I did play the first one briefly until I rage quit and sold it. <laughs> but I really like I've I've had this one for a little bit, but I haven't really done anything with it. So we'll see what happens. I've heard basically good things. Okay. So this is going to be hard to read and discuss with you unless I'm reading what out loud what I'm seeing, but we'll see how this goes. Anyway, how's everybody doing? All like 17 followers on Twitch that I have that might see this. And eventually... All you YouTube subscribers out there, hi! Both the jumper and the quadcopter can take pictures. That's good to know. You can take pictures from unusual angles. All right. This is loading forever. Forever. Like Marky Mark in fear. I love you forever. CITAS. Server Farm, San Francisco. San Fran. Uh oh. I'm breaking and entering right now, aren't I? Consider this your 10 second initiation retro. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to bypass Bloom security doors and get inside. Then find and erase your personal CTOS profile. Whatever they have on me, it's all bullshit. And I'm sick of getting harassed for it. All the more reason huh. for a purge. We'll be watching. Try to keep up. By the way, we put this playlist together to set the mood. Hope you like it. Oh, that was effective. What is my eventual goal here? Where am I trying to go? Oh, into that door. Wow. Poop on a stick. Apparently I am in the wrong field. I need to become a security officer. Looks like you just like s walk around and scratch your junk and like sneeze. Apparently get shot in the back by my taser. Yeah, you did, but now you're all tased out, and, um... So... So, I'm here now. Do I just pack it? Oh, find the closed circuit terminal. I see.
Well, that was convenient. My phone doesn't have that app. <laughs> Just backflipped off a building. I'm a parkour king. You're wasting your time. Am I, though? He's not in. Gotcha. So that's him. He's got a gun. Is that a problem? Well, problems are why you keep me around, right? Time him. I'm curious. Too late. He's in. Already? Yeah, cuz I'm awesome. Give me a real answer. I'm just not that into aliens or video games. It's not just any alien. It's oh, come on. Anyone else having a problem with their phone? Oh god. Oh god. What is that? I need one. Is it just like a ball of rope Ooh, on a rope? <laughs> retro. The home domain awareness hacker? That retro? Yes. We told you that already? Yeah, I never listen. This crouch run thing is really driving me nuts. Just run. Oh, what the... I need to find some kind of key card or something to be able to like get up there. And I thought it'd be on one of the security guards, but apparently it's like way outside of this room. But I don't know how to get outside of the room without having the freaking key. So seems like this whole catch 22 thing that I'm stuck in right now. I'm just going to run back and forth a few more thousand <laughs> times and then maybe I'll get it. He was moving. <laughs> why? 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 There's nothing helpful here. Why is one guy red and one guy is gray? This makes no sense at all. Yeah, I see your little red arrow. I see where you want me to go. There's no way to get there. Dumbasses. Yeah, I get it. Freaking find the key. Okay, so I've looked at the same thing like literally five times now. Is there something I can pick up on this like anywhere? There's gotta be something in here. I'm so fucking stuck. Why? What am I missing? Don't you have something on you? Don't you have a key card? I mean, otherwise you two would be stuck in this damn room too. 
One of them gray because he's dead. Too bad I can't just sit down and like read one of those magazines over there because we're not going anywhere, are we? Maybe I shouldn't have started this out fresh and twitched it at the same time because this is stupid. Okay, so none of this stuff will help me. Can't my phone, like, work? I mean, it opened up the outside door. It won't open up the inside door, too. There's not an app for that. This is dumb. I'm just to, like chill. I'm gonna sit on this guy, use him as a seat, even though there's a perfectly good couch over here. Just get out my computer, hack the planet. Shit. about to lose my mind there. This dude's gonna end up with a slip disc if he keeps his crouch on BS up. Raised in Oakland but was born in... <laughs> his deal is, he's been hanging around the DedSec IRC and he's got crashed. Figured we'd give him a test drive. On the hardest difficulty, nobody's been able to delete their CTOS profile before. I want to see if he's smart, stubborn, or both. I'm going to go with both. That sounds right. Somebody's shooting at me. Where am I getting shot at from? I was so close. Hey, DB, stop shooting at me. Nifty little keyboard right there. Man out, find him. He's done this before. CTOS tagged him as the prime suspect in a high tech burglary. So he's done time. Community service, not enough evidence. Just the word of CTOS's predictive algorithms. But once in the system, always in the system. So close. Yay! Holy shit! He went for it. You won't have much time before the backups kick in. Do we have eyes on the target? Keep your eyes open. Man out. 
I'm inside the server tower. That doesn't sound like what I want to do. That sounds like the opposite of what I want to do. Still. Give the man props. He's going the mile. <laughs> his glasses fit better than mine. His look more cosmetic. It doesn't look like he has glass in his glasses. But if I was in a super hot room like that, mine would just be slip sliding down my nose. Fogging up something. So no explanation of what just happened? Sure. So I climbed inside a super hot thing to play on my computer a little bit. And then I just climbed right back out. <laughs> I mean, cool, I guess. Whatever. Come out, give up. Parkour King, yes. Oh wow. This looks like a hacker's dream. Okay, hack the terminal to reveal the network bypass nodes. Hmm. Tap the left button to rotate nodes and redirect power. Hack the last node and the network bypass. Okay then. That doesn't sound complicated at all. Dudes are still there. Super sleeping. So that's the one I already did, right? So now...
Yay! Alright, it all came together, finally. I don't think I like this game very much. What the fuck? I'm just gonna Why put it out there. What's <laughs> a noodle search? Do I want to? I don't want to know what that is. Never mind. I take it back. <laughs> It's all gone. Don't exist. Just gonna drop a little back door into the system so I can get back inside later. Sorry, Bloom. We've got unfinished business. He's heading out. Bag him. Yeah. Alrighty then. So escape. Okay, new thing to learn. What was that? That was maybe an awesome. Verifying target. Enforcements have been called, son of a bitch. Explosives? I don't even know where I'm going. This is terrible. So I can get out of here. Come on, mother trucker, just go through the door. You can shoot me through a glass door? That's not fair. I can't shoot you through the door. Ass. Oh, up behind me. Bastard sauce. The hell? Let me get out of here. Come on. Cheap ass motherfucker. 
Okay, just keep going down the stairs. Got it. Where do the stairs go? Again. Awesome. God fucking damn it. Man out, find him. Where do Okay, so there's gotta be a way. I just jump off the side. Closer, finally, for the love. Hold it right there. I don't want to. Help him. Where the fuck am I go? Josh. Okay. Okay. Fuck you, Bloom. <laughs> Aw, damn. I got cocky. Now I'm gonna pay for it. In 2013, Chicago realized the promise of smart cities with CTOS, a citywide operating system merging big data with surveillance, security, and transit programs. With a few hundred lines of code, hackers were able to hijack its central servers and cripple the Finally, entire grid. got past Many that level. Yay. For smart city development. They were that wrong. wasn't at all Four frustrating. From the heart of Silicon Valley, CTOS 2.0 has been implemented across the United States, ushering in the Internet of Things. 6.4 billion connected devices now serve as collection points, mapping and recording our daily routines, making a more secure and more invasive system. But who else is listening? Big Brother no longer works alone. Thousands of little brothers monitor and aggregate your every move building a complete digital profile of you to be bought, sold, or stolen in an instant. Toys study your children, reporting their play habits back to marketers. Appliances, That's consoles, terrifying. and home security systems give corporations a window into your private life. Control of your vehicle yeah, I knew and that. mobile device can now be breached remotely by anyone at any time. You may think that I've you actually are heard that too. or underestimate the risk, but your digital shadow is already compromised. Insurance companies use algorithms to monitor your life habits and limit or deny coverage. Health providers determine if your cancer is worth treating. Search results and news feeds are skewed to bias mood and influence your vote, engineering social uprisings on a massive scale. You are now less valuable than the data you produce. Data you produce. This is the new reality. Going I have heard that also. Is no longer an option. With threats to personal freedom rising, many are stepping forward. Whistleblowers, activists, and hackers have drawn their battle lines, putting the establishment on watch. But are they threats themselves, or have they become freedom's last line of defense? Freedom's last line of defense. I'm feeling dehydrated. <laughs> so? Am I in? Welcome to Dead Sec. I'm Satara. This sweetheart is Josh, aka Hot Sauce. Yo, you're Hot Sauce? Yeah, man, I loved your frat house hat. Real talk. Thanks. This weirdo's right. <laughs> <laughs> and this Casanova is Horatio. What's up, brother? Man. It's the crew, huh? Took y'all long enough to come get me. Shit. You saw Bloom bullshit. CTOS isn't just regulating infrastructure. The amount of personal. Oh, look, data actual glasses. I'm wearing sunglasses at night. It's Big Brother. I mean, I can't say that I've never personally done that, but I'm just saying. It's an interesting stance to take, all of a sudden. Thank you, Josh. 
by the fire. So what's the fix? Sledgehammers and fire. No, sledgehammers on fire. <laughs> All that data in one place means. How's that dude drink with that big mask on? He's got a beer. It can't go nowhere. He's got a straw. What the hell? Just for show. That's not even the worst case scenario. All that data in the hands of the government? They'll arrest you before you even do it. Yeah, I've been there. He's got a little drink flap. fucking know why. Fuck it. Fuck it, man. We're hackers. We we out think we out there. I, I say we tear down the fucking wall. Hey, show everyone what what Bloom's up to, man. Show show the world that their personal data is being used to rob them of their fucking freedoms. Fuck. I installed a back door, so all we gotta do is walk right through. <laughs> Hold on. You what? He installed the back door, so all we have to do is walk through. Bingo. <laughs> <laughs> I like that kid. <laughs> hey, man. Do you have the time? Oh, yeah, man. Uh, I got it. I got it. Uh oh. Kind of late for a night run, isn't it? Hey, what, are you, what are you running from the cops? <laughs> Maybe I am one. Hey, hey you, you look familiar. <laughs> Have a good party. That was random. King, this mother. Fuck you, Bloom. I'm gonna go have a goddamn good time. Dude needs to hold his liquor better. You can go charge them instantly by hacking civilians with the lightning hack? Lightning hack. Ghost in the machine, I get it. Aha! Ha ha ha. It's funny. Hello. Ubisoft. Whose phone is this? It's your new phone. My new where phone? Where's my phone? In the ocean, where you threw it, I think. I don't remember. I was pretty smashed. Look, meet us at the hacker space. Where? Check your pics and figure it out. You may do work with a hangover? That's mean. Can I just go back to sleep now? <clears throat> Yo, whose place am I in? Okay, so I'm going to try to talk over this song so it doesn't make me have a copyright claim on my YouTube when I post it, but it's probably still going to F it up. So, yay, pictures with hangover. He's got poop on his pants <laughs> and unicorns. <laughs> poop and unicorns. <laughs> sure. Shorts. I guess I was lit, huh? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> like Mardi Gras. Go get yourself something to wear, and I'll tell you where to go next. Oh. And you'll need your phone ready for operations. So hit the store and download your apps before you get here. Damn, walk of shame on my first day. So, okay then. I have to go to an app shop and get stuff. Alright. Maps. Cool. Now I can see where I'm going. That guy just laughed at my clothes, didn't he? God damn it. Let's see my pictures. See what I need to do. Go get some clothes that don't look ridiculous. Although, 
I, I would probably totally rock those as jammies. Just saying. Poop emoji unicorn pants. Sure. I'd sleep in those. <laughs> I, I don't I don't think I would leave the house in them. <laughs> but... <laughs> Dangerous game, man. I am. I thought I could just shut myself off in my apartment. Peekaboo? Hey, uh, you can change in the back. Have a good one. Thanks. On one of my breaks. My bad. What in the hot hell? No. Uh, can I just have like a regular shirt, please? Does it have to be? Okay, so I need different pants for sure. It has a deer <laughs> on it. <laughs> Okay, how ridiculous can I make him look? That's what I'm going for now. Alright, Sitar, so where you at? Sending you the location and the passcode for the door. Can I Uber a ride? That's a long walk. There's a place where they plan their operations. More will appear as I progress through the game. That's super good to know. Okay. Just gonna run into traffic now. Oh, I can just take your truck? Cool. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna steal it in style. <laughs> Steal it with some flair and then run some people down. That's my goal. Oh damn. I'm gonna wreck this truck before I make it around the block. God damn it. Back to parkour. Oh, sandbox. What the f records was that? Do you know what that was? Oh, I can't talk to you. Okay. Wee. See that every day. Oops, sorry. Like what you've done with the place. Yo, finally. 
finally. So Josh and I spoke, and fucking over Bloom has been a long-standing project. All right, you need two things to take down Bloom. You need to get people to rally behind your cause and separate you from the trolls. And we need bots, and a lot of them to handle the data CTOS is processing. Thank you, Josh. We spent all night modifying our app so you can get followers to download the app, and we can use their processing power for the cause. This is happening? It's really happening? Mm -hmm. Yeah, man, this is happening. You better get to it. <laughs> Hell yeah, man! Barbarians are at the gate and ready to bust some Roman heads. And yeah, we're gonna focus on some high-profile ops, playing for exposure and laughs to get people to I wonder if they had anybody uh, with tattoos design right. that guy's tattoos. Because uh, <laughs> they are not good. Marcus! <laughs> Check you out! And if I'm not being clear, they're bad. I wasn't sure after your moonlight swim. Come here. You've got to check this out. I am right here. Literally right next to you. Behold, our very own open source research app. So, like, all of us here pool vulnerabilities that we find. And we encourage everyone to share their work, their research, etc. Okay, so what's the research app do? Widen our skill set? Make us irresistible to the... Okay, so you just talk a lot. In your electro voice. Now I can drive someone else's car. All right. The original Chicago DedSec has coordinated operations. Everybody mostly working towards the same goal. Rumors say that the leaderless group actually has somebody upstairs calling the shots. The Behold, days. the wonders of technology. A 3D Someone printer. This is the army of printers. It is capable of pumping out an arsenal of lethal weapons down. Seriously? Yep. Once you master it, voila! Hipster merchant of death. All good, except I'm no hipster. <laughs> you keep telling yourself that. Now try to make something. But don't blow up. Okay, so what, am I done talking with you? Oh, I have to print a weapon, print the RC jumper, and interact with the printer. Okay. Cool. Print any weapon, apparently. I just got a gun out of the magic box. I love it. I love the rainbow unicorn. The, well, the rainbow coming out of the unicorn butt. Because that's how we, how we all know that rainbows are made. So, do I, like, talk to you or what? I can't. It says I gotta get closer to you. Now what? don't understand why I need to be closer to you. Okay, let's just do something else. So what do you what do you around here for fun? What do you mean? This is fun. Yeah, but outside this place. No. Right. Uh, nice talk, Josh. Let's talk about Satara. She's been driving DedSec in the Bay Area. The hacker space? She's paying for it with, uh, <laughs> borrowed money. <laughs> Every... 
So we've been looking at this new guy, calls himself Retro. Now, I like his style. Spent some time in Oakland. In fact, that's where he earned some of his hacker credit. I read everything I could about it when it was All right, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Why do I have to get closer to you? They rolled out cameras in Oakland and started stockpiling data on everybody. Somehow Retro got targeted by the thing and programmed on his computer skills and marked him as a prime suspect in the local high-tech robbery. The evidence was all digital. Nothing put him at the scene of the crime. And the case was a shit show. Full of quotes from people who didn't know anything about technology. Lies everywhere. False flags and fear mongering. They weren't about to admit to a flaw in their system. Retro got lucky. He got a judge that decided not to throw the book at him. So he ended up. The wrench. <laughs> Man, what to say about this guy? Some freaky shit going on right there. I'd like to say he's actually. Okay. So. I don't understand what I need to do next. Can I leave? I have to, like, do something. I have to interact with you on some level. Can I just steal your computer? Sup, dude? Can I do the computer on the other side? Talk to Horatio. I'm trying to talk to him. God damn it. Understand what the hell? This is stupid. This really sucks. It's so we've just. Been looking at this new guy calls himself Retro. I know. I he heard your story. Time. In fact, that's where you earned some of his hacker cred. Can't talk to him because he's just sitting at a computer and he won't interact with me. Had to deal with Homeland Security. DeadSec found Josh, hot sauce, posting anti-CTOS videos on invite. Kid had a plastic Halloween mask over his face, a skull. But like the worst dollar this. store skull this you could stupid. find. You can see his eyes through it. Big no-no when it comes to avoiding a profiler. He had a distorted okay, voice. I'm just gonna stare at you. I'm gonna stare at the Josh side of your head. You look at me when I walk up to you. Means he's got a very so if I just stare at you, found him easily, but will you like finally be like, what the hell are you staring at? Down to pure coding, Josh operates on a higher level than the rest of us. We got to look at a CTOS profile and all kinds of nasty flags popped up. Emotionally challenged, unstable, even a low mental maturity score. He's none of those things, and he quickly became the activist soul of our group. He has a black and white way of seeing things, fair and unfair, which means he can be refreshing and often hilarious. I can't leave. We caught a I can't leave until I CTOS do whatever Delta. I have to do with that Rejected stupid program, dumbass. Cut funding, overcharges. We offer to help him make things right. When we met Josh, he had the right intentions and the wrong approach, like a laser putting on a pretty light show instead of burning holes. Oh, and this game is dumb. Wants to make him unemployable, damn straight we're gonna snatch him up and point him right back at him. Stuff like this makes me wish that somebody else did Harley's first view. This is stupid. I'm done. I don't know what the fuck to do, and I'm just over it. So, I'm going to leave.